everyone welcome back to my channel um, this is going to be a kind of studio vlog possibly over a couple of days but I wanted to come up with some designs for my shop and yeah just show you the process of doing that um, but yeah so I mentioned before that I really want to use print on demand uh, websites more um, but yeah just to kind of use them for products that I can't make myself and also uh, yeah, and also just to sort of test out different products as well. And yes, yeah, so I was thinking about what kind of designs I want to make. Um, and last October, uh, for Inktober, um, I created all these like collages and I made this book out of them. Um, but yeah, and I really love these like ghost characters. Um, but yeah, so I want to do something with them but I don't want to just like put that image and like slap it on some products I want to kind of yeah recreate some of the designs um obviously it depends from product to product but obviously things are going to be like different like sizes and formats and stuff so uh yeah so that's my plan I've got lots of tea to keep me going um, also, if you're wondering why there is a plant shaped hole there, um, that is because, like I mentioned before, we've been redecorating the dining room and um, yeah, we've been putting all these shells up and we just decided that it needed some plants. So yeah, my plant has been stolen, um, but it actually looks really nice downstairs. And to be fair, I didn't realise how much that plant grew and it was kind of like it was like a sort of hanging plant so yeah I will insert a photo or some footage of that but yeah that's that's looking really nice but now I need another plant to go there <laughs> Yeah, I'm really liking how this is going at the moment. I think the 
ghosts are coming out really cute um i've been using if you're interested i've been using this tombow pen and uh but yeah have you been using like the tiny um side and then what's this this is a uni a uni pin fine liner i think i just got it from like hobbycraft or something it's a 0 0.3 oh can't focus but yeah so i think now i'm gonna have a go at doing some of the leaves let me show you what it looks like so far but yeah i think it's uh i think it's coming out really cute um i do want to do a little bit more detail on the scar so like here i've used this this pen yeah i've used this pen to do some of the, the like finer details on the scarf so I think I'm going to do that for the rest of them um, and then as you might be able to see through my light box I've, um, I'm going to do some leaves I think I won't do an outline for the leaves and I think I'm just going to do them with some coloured pencils Friday now um, you get a little glimpse of my messy cupboard again I don't have a door on this cupboard and yeah I need to organize it at some point but I kind of don't want to have that as a distraction at the moment but yeah um, a future job so I'm really happy with how these ghosts uh, have come out so far um, but yeah so this is the drawing that I did yesterday and then on a separate piece of paper I did some more these are kind of like wind swells we'll call them um yes yeah, so I've been doing that and then I've just been editing them getting rid of any of like the whites and all the sort of um little sort of specks and things uh getting rid of all of that because I don't really want those little specks printed um but yeah and then I think I want to yeah make it into a pattern but I was thinking it might be nice to have some like trees um and maybe some benches as well in like the original drawing or collage that I did um I had them sitting on a bench so but yeah I'm also I'm not sure if they're looking like snowmen or not so yeah I don't know if I should do something else behind them as well to make them look more like ghosts and less like snowmen so I think part of what was making them look more like snowmen and less like ghosts was the fact that they had feet and um, so I wanted to try them with kind of a more kind of floaty ghosty bottom <laughs> if you know what I mean um, and rather than redraw the whole thing I thought I would just use my light box and put another piece of paper over it and then just draw like the bottom of the ghost and then I could sort of match that up in Photoshop. Um, but yes, yeah, so that's what I'm doing here. And yeah, I think I think it turned out quite well. Um, I really liked the ghost, the ghost with feet. Um, but yeah, I think with the addition of the scarves, they just looked too much like snowmen and yeah I think they're they're looking really cute now so on photoshop I've done like a sort of uh, transparent opaque is that the word I'm looking for um but yeah slightly transparent like 
white it's sort of like a chalky texture but yeah i thought that would hopefully give them like a nice ghost quality it's a few days later and you might be able to tell that my hair is a different colour because I um, put some henna on it um, so I used the henna that was from Lush um, it's called like maroon maroon yeah I'm feeling kind of autumnal um, I think I like wanted my hair to like match that um, but yeah and even though it's summer it's been kind of cold um, which is why I am in this jumper, which has got, I love this jumper, it's got this lovely owl on it. Um, but yeah, so I've been working on these ghosts, I've been downloading different templates from Printful, been working on like a tote bag design, and what else? Oh, Printful do stickers as well, so yeah, that's really exciting, especially because I've ordered stickers myself before and I think the stickers that I've ordered are great but yeah that I've just got so many so I really think that doing the print on demand thing is great because it means you can like test out different products and different designs so yeah I'm, uh, I'm looking forward to that you can get you can either do like individual stickers or you can do a little like square sticker sheet where you have like up to five individual stickers on that so yeah I've designed that I've designed a couple of t-shirts with a ghost on yeah I like the idea of each different product having a slightly different design on it um but yeah so I've done a mug design as well and obviously the template for that is a lot longer um or a lot wider than it is for a t-shirt design so yeah so it's just a case of using the same elements but just kind of moving them around which yeah that's been fun pictures of california my order on Printful um, they do something called like a sample thing where you can order like um, up to three products and they give you a, like a little bit of a discount so yeah I've done that I've ordered two t-shirts um, so I've ordered one with like three ghosts on um, and it's got like a kind of mauve design um, I've also ordered one that is just like a white t-shirt with um, one big ghost couple on oh and then the other thing i've ordered is a tote bag as well so yeah i'm looking forward to seeing how those turn out um i think i'm going to end the video here though uh, so if you're wanting to see what those products turn out then definitely subscribe to my channel and yeah leave me a like and a comment and i'll see you in the next video bye